there are seven basic principles of ethics and those seven basic principles need to be understood absolutely well before we even get into the compliance model so seven basic principles are what first trust what does trust mean trust means confidence in one another second compassion compassion means an understanding of another's challenges somebody else's challenges that is the second important thing the third is courage what is the strength to face the adversity because courage is an important element if you need to comply with ethical laws then comes justice a concern for fairness are we fair in our actions in our decisions then comes wisdom wisdom means having good and sound judgment and last is temperance not last temperance temperance means how tolerant how self reliant are you how self restraining are you so a lot of elements come into temperance and the last is hope hope is having a positive optimistic expectation of the future positive and optimistic expectation of the future now once we have these seven elements combined what you will realize is that these seven elements are the foundational principles of ethical practices in any organization इसको कंप्लायंस क्यों बोलते हैं इसको कंप्लायंस इसलिए बोलते हैं बिकॉज इट कंप्लाइज यू नीड टू कंप्लाई विद एथिकल लॉस एथिकल रूल्स बिकॉज यू आर नॉट जस्ट अ सेल्फिश पर्सन वन स्वार्थी यू आर ऑल्सो यू ऑल्सो प्ले अ रोल ऑफ ए ऑफ अ मेंबर ऑफ अ परिवार सो यू आर सपोज टू बिहेव लाइक ए परिवार थी you are a member of a society and a community and a nation so you have to behave like a parokar thing and also you are a member of this globe of this planet earth so you have you have responsibility towards the globe you have responsibility towards planet earth be it environment be it people so you have to be parmarthi now ye char principles four principles swarthi take care of yourself parivarthi take care of your family parokarthi take care of your community nation society and parmarthi take care of the globe are exactly applied on to the principles of corporate governance now three major things which we discussed yesterday first whatever you do whatever you do that needs to come under the framework of all the four elements that you have to take care of one is you as a body corporate yourself so your responsibility towards it you have responsibility towards the society that you are living in the nation that you are living in you have responsibility towards the globe and you have responsibility towards yourself so when you look at all these four things four elements you therefore come into a clarity that what is that i need to do in terms of a body corporate mm-hmm.